Good morning, sleepyhead. Good morning. Thank you. <laughs> the best thing is that they have free coffee every day, so my so my parents can deal with me. <laughs> so this is Canoe, which is their fancy restaurant, which we've eaten at, and it's very good. But they also do a complimentary breakfast for people that book directly with the hotel, and it was super yummy today. Amelia, you're not just eating jam by itself, are you? No. What are you doing? <laughs> Stuck in my bacon and the jam. <laughs> <laughs> That's ridiculous. Enjoy, I guess it's vacation. Mine, are you enjoying breakfast? Mm -hmm. What's the best part? Milk. <laughs> so one of the cool things about this place is in addition to operating as a hotel, it also operates as a timeshare. So people can buy ownership in one of the units uh, and they offer up their units for rent on VRBO or Airbnb, where you can sometimes find cool deals. So on this trip, we booked through the hotel directly, uh, which offers some benefits, like you get free breakfast and all kinds of cool perks. Uh, but we have actually even looked into buying one of the timeshares. That's a really cool deal. Check it out. Lots of cool stuff to do here. All right, cool. What did you find, Amelia? I found an ice cream parlor. You found an ice cream parlor. Do you remember being here before? Uh huh. It looks like it's not open right now, but they offer really good ice cream. And do you remember what I know about this place? What? When they have the ice cream, they have people wearing silly hats. <laughs> Pretty cool, right? We do like a good silly hat. Now, Mommy, this morning, went over here to the spa. Yeah, it was really nice. They have a movie theater. It's so cool. I don't think there's any movies. You want to sneak open the door? Oh, check it out. It's legit. You guys, Amelia Wyatt. Amelia. So, we're not watching a movie right now. We just wanted to see the space. It's so cool. They do multiple showings a day. They have kids shows. They have classic movies. They have first run movies. All kinds of cool stuff. Yeah. And a pretty big screen. Yeah, that's a nice setup. It's all This way, Wyatt. Game room. You found a game room. So this is not exactly my idea of a vacation activity, but obviously most people would probably make use. They have great facilities. <clears throat> but noticeably, they do not have a Peloton. Mike works for Peloton. So we're here in the summer. Uh, this area is a great three season destination. It's also, of course, extremely popular in the winter. They even hosted the Winter Olympics here. And so you might think, why do they have such a nice pool to be uh, somewhere that you come in the winter? And that's because uh, the pool is heated all year round. So you can actually go swimming all year round. So to get to the pool, you don't want to go outside in the freezing snow. They have underground passageways where you can go straight from your hotel room to the pool, in your bathrobe, stay warm, dry, until you're ready to get in the pool, and it's great. All right, let's check it out. Um, now we're at the secret passageway to the pool. Are we ready to go swimming right now, Amelia? No, we're going back to our hotel room. I actually have laundry facilities here because when people have the timeshare, they stay for a week. So, you know, laundry comes up. But also, every unit we've stayed at here has had laundry in the unit, like ours does. So, I don't know who's using these so much. We are ready for a minute to go. Outdoor pool, it's heated to like 90 degrees all year round. So even in the middle of winter, you can go swimming. They have two hot tubs, one that kids can go in and one for adults. So we're gonna be out here playing and maybe we'll bring the GoPro so we can get some shots. And right over there, they have a pond where you can go fishing in. And Amelia's been fishing there before too. Catch and release only. <laughs> so it's really very pretty. Uh, we're not seeing the best of it here in the drizzle, but uh, we'll have to show you again later. It's a uh, very nice grounds around the whole area. Do you guys wanna go swimming even though it's raining? Yeah. Maybe right. just in the middle of the pool. Or maybe in all the pools. So we're in our elevator and we're heading to the pool. 
Are you excited, Wyatt? Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. I'm uh, taking some time to catch up on some video editing. You know, we just got back from the pool and we're just taking some chill time. Wyatt is taking a nap, which very much needs one. Amelia is having a little quiet time with her iPad. And uh, yeah, pretty soon I think we'll go into town, walk around, see some shops, get some dinner. It'll be great. So where are we headed to next? So it's a really gloomy day. We were super tempted to stay inside all day, but we want to go to the town of Lake Placid and just walk around some cute little shops and grab some dinner away from the resort. Because although it's amazing, there's some incredible food up here and it's really no fun to just stay at the hotel the whole time. <laughs> So if you can hear me over these never-ending bells, this is Mirror Lake, which is the lake that the town of Lake Pass is on, and it's pretty even on a rainy day like this. We've been shopping around a little bit, and um, I don't know if you like the kits, but um, <laughs> I've been having knee problems, which makes me feel like I am three times the age of any other travel vlogging family out there. I'm 36, so maybe I am. But um, we have a big international trip coming up soon, so I kind of wanted to try and get ahead of that. So the new sneakers will hopefully help with that. So we're just kind of going to little stores. We bought some books and I'm um, going to go to dinner soon. But in the meantime, we're looking at how pretty the, the lake is. So the kids got really hungry, so we stopped into this little place called, see right here, it's the Great Adirondack Brewing Company. We've been here a couple times, they have great beers, and I always get the flights. There's seven of them, so that should be a nice way to start the day. Mm -hmm. And we got some chowder and other yummy food, because it kind of looks like a New England pub in here, and you can't beat the view out of that right now. So where are we going next, Amelia? Um, we're going bowling at the Wake Face Lodge. How fun! All right, Mike. You think you're the bowlingest? Give us a little bowling butt dance, and let's see if you should earn the big bucks. next international destination we go to. I know we have a time that we're waiting to decide where we go. What do you think? Sure, sure. All right. Buy cars. 
they talk think think Mater is a spy car too. Mater will help them find the bad cars. Bad cars are bad. That's Ray Wyatt. Mm-hmm. Holly gives Mater So the kids are asleep and we are enjoying some super cozy time by the fireplace. We are watching a little bit of TV about um, our next international destination. Can you guess by the screen where we're going? Look at all the bicycles. (laughs) Well, that's one of the countries we're going to soon. And um, right now, though, we're just enjoying taking a little bit of time to relax before we go back to doing some more video editing. And right now I'm double fisting. This is like, you know, the 30-year-old double fist. I got (laughs) tea in one hand, wine in the other. Pretty next level. Cheers. Cheers.